Hey everyone, it's the Curve Dog again. Today, okay, I'm going to go over an unboxing and a little bit about how it works. This is a phone that I found on trackphone.com. I was looking for another phone. This is a Motorola W370G. It's a mini version of the uh, old type Razer phones that we all had back in the old days. So, this is the phone I'm looking for for my wife. She doesn't like hers because it's really kind of hard to operate. So, this one, okay, I found online at Track Phone, as I mentioned. Uh, it came with the, the phone. It came with a 60-minute uh, airtime card and overnight FedEx delivery for $19.99. Now, the airtime card by itself is $19.99, so I think it's a really good deal. Anyway, let me go ahead and show you how this unboxes what all's in the packaging when you get it. So, this is the usual uh, track phone tub, as I call it, and it opens up. I've already had it opened up before, so it's not quite that easy, but this is how it basically works. Track phone comes out. And as we can see, it is like the old type razors. My Motorola. SIM card already comes installed, as you can see. And let's go ahead now. We'll do the rest of the box. Kind of falls apart, which is cool. What you get inside, okay, is you get a wall charger. Charge it up. Mr. Battery, and a backing plate that goes onto the back of the phone. Data Services Quick Guide kind of shows you how to go about setting it up. Terms and condition of service, it's a track phone. Uh, you can send this in right here for an insider, so you can get all kinds of junk mail and spam. Important summary. Your user's guide. I highly recommend that you read these things, too, when you before you start it up. I was setting hers up with the speed dial, and it's a little bit confusing and tricky. But I read the book. And it explains how to do it, and guess what? It actually works. Activation card, and as usual, I do not like to show the numbers. Here, I'll do it like that. It's in English on the one side, Spanish on the other side. And Motorola, the Moto Manual for Motorola. If you want to read all that stuff, it's good to do. All right. That all goes out of the way. Okay, as I mentioned, okay, your SIM card's already installed. On this one, okay, it has provisions, or I'm sorry, it does not have provisions for an external memory card. If it does, I don't know where it goes. Because it shows it, uh, it can do it, but I don't see a slot for it anywhere at all. So, put the battery in. Notice you have your contacts. Then the battery also, you have the lower contacts. Make sure those are lined up. It goes in like so. Push down the front. When you get it in there, let me turn it this way. There we go. And pop it in. Take your backing plate. It slides on and lock it. And a little click there. Remember, in cell phones and in uh, camera, or in uh, cell phones and cameras, snaps are good. Okay. Now, turn it on, okay, as all track phones. We use the, pull the plastic off here. The uh, red button is the uh, end or power on button. So we're going to go ahead and push that. And... On she goes. Hello, Moto. There's also plastic on here I'm going to take off. Protects that screen. 
pretty narrow screen too as you can see and this is an old type phone from what I can gather on the packaging this one was at Big Lots before and I guess it came back and they're selling it this one as I mentioned okay went for the card 60 minute airtime card the phone plus overnight delivery FedEx for $19.99. I saw it this morning on trackphone.com and they have the phone by itself for five dollars. Five bucks. And then whatever it costs for uh, shipping if you want to buy it by itself. Okay. So that right there, okay, is the W370 Motorola track phone. And the center button, okay, you push that, that brings up your your menu and then you can scroll through it to get wherever you want to go phone book messages office tools games and apps web access multimedia and settings okay now a trick that I found okay that we had I had to do no, I don't want to do that that's getting me onto the web I'm going to cancel that out exit browser yeah 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 okay I know okay now to get the speed dial set up and I had a hard time finding this so I'm gonna show you how to do it you go down to your initial setup I hope you can see that and then you press the center button that brings you up like that now right here okay the eye touch dial you have a choice on this of taking it to the phone or the sim card you want to have it on phone it's got to be on phone for it to work okay. now you're all set for the one touch dial and then when you do go in to do your settings for your phone book press on that okay and that brings you up we'll go down the new entry here and then you put in the new category whatever it might be and you do everything that you need to do and then you go ahead and you would click the okay it's all done to set up for the speed dial okay you pick a number between one I think it's this one here is not set up yet okay see it's empty and you can set it up okay by going into when you set up the uh, address book you put it in there is a line that you can do for what choice you want to have for between one I think it's 365 you can do a lot of them in here and you just type it in there and you hit done and it'll store it and then when you want to dial you just press the one I'll do the one here for voicemail and see it automatically dials it I'm gonna turn it off but that's how you do the speed dial easy to do but if you don't know what you're doing like I didn't know earlier it can be very very confusing and very very frustrating but that my friends is the track phone Motorola W370 and when you go to charge it up, okay, you have a little port on the side here that opens up. You plug in your USB. Now, I try hooking it up to my computer, okay, and it would not charge with the computer. It's got to be through the wall socket. It's probably a setting that I've got to fit up on there. This side here, you can plug it into like a 12-volt DC from your car, and you can charge it that way, too. And that's that, but... That is the Motorola W370 track phone. And I hope you enjoyed it. It was a you know, good video to make. It's a good little phone. I uh, hope my wife likes it. If she doesn't, I guess I'll be buying another phone pretty soon. But again, thank you for watching. Have a good day. This is the Crew Dog. Out.